FM, this is it's over, and today we're going to talk about the top five features of Flutterflow 4. So let's begin with number one. So number one will be actually screenshots generator. And now you can actually generate screenshots that when you deploy your app for uh, App Store or Play Store, you actually will be able to configure your screenshots and actually generate screenshots by selected pages, which is actually game changer for me. I was asking for that since I first deployed my app because it's so consuming, time consuming to actually deploy the apps uh, using a third party or creating the uh, screenshots yourself. And that's actually huge. Thank you for the flow for that. Number two in the list is branching. Actually, branching will give you the, abili the ability to have a production uh, project and a test project inside Flutterflow projects. And actually works like GitHub inside Flutterflow. And there could be like a couple of people working at the same project and you can still actually uh, have different branchings. And then you can actually just uh, merge the branchings and you can see the difference between the new branch and the old branch and you can resolve conflicts for example uh, and that's actually great there were a lot of people asking for that feature so i'm really happy that this is coming in for the flow for 4.0 so a great news and you can see the history as well so that's amazing and number three, it's cloud functions. Now you actually have the ability to create cloud functions inside Flutterflow directly. And you can actually uh, just create it with custom code, just you create it with custom functions, custom widgets, but now you have the ability to create them inside your uh, uh, Flutterflow UI builder. And you can actually write JavaScript because uh, they are in JavaScript language and you can deploy them. Right, you can deploy them from within Flutterflow and you can actually use them. If you open the actions, now you have the ability to select cloud functions as well. So that's huge actually, that will actually save you a lot of time and will not mess you with terminals. Uh, and that's, that's actually a huge news. So thank you Flutter for that as well. Create news. Number four in the list is the new marketplace. So they were actually, Flutterflow were actually working a lot about the marketplace. And the marketplace will actually, the new marketplace will actually have paid items. So you can actually sell your paid items in the marketplace. You can have your whole projects and you can sell them in the marketplace. So I think in the marketplace in the future will be actually much more uh, robust with much more uh, items that uh, will actually have value because right now uh, a lot of uh, a lot of items in the marketplace um, are great but still they're free so i think in coming uh, future marketplace will be more valuable so that's that's amazing number five in my list is actually testing and for the flow right now you can create automatic testing and you can uh, have the name you can description and you can have the test steps and you can have something like load this widget and do this and do this action like long press press uh like enter this value like enter the email enter the password and then you can have it tested automatically to actually open your app click on something so there is actually no no more from you to actually go inside the app and test it manually so that's actually a great thing it's much appreciated it's uh, amazing i cannot wait for version 4.0 and thank you for the flow for featuring me inside the conference much appreciated and before we go is community champions of the year and this is a very exciting award uh, for us because these are individuals who have contributed on the community forums, answered questions to all your uh, like questions that you had about Flutterflow, and also shared tips and tricks on like social platforms. So these are our community champions of the year. We have Sergey Middendorf.
Dimitar Klatterov. And thank you very much for for, for that. Uh, I was actually surprised. Uh, thank you very much. It's much appreciated. Uh, I uh, will do my best to answer all your questions. And like right now, I'm actually living in my Discord server. So if you have any questions, I think it's it will be faster answered in my Discord channel. And thank you very much for everyone. Thank you very much for the support. Uh, thank you very much. Yeah, it's it's great. I feel I feel great. Thank you. And let's keep on pushing, guys.